Hey, it's Aurelius. Welcome back to the channel. In this video, you're going to learn five AI tools that will help speed up and take your content creation to the next level with very little effort. You'll discover a tool that can generate a full online course based on some simple text prompts, a tool that turns any YouTube video into multiple types of content pieces from reels to tweets to even full blog posts. Or what about a tool that can turn all those ideas and messy thoughts into clear, structured and ready to publish publish articles. Well, you'll learn all that plus more in this video, starting with the first tool. This first AI tool is called Auto Repurpose AI. And what this will do is repurpose any YouTube video into content for Twitter threads or X in this case, LinkedIn posts, newsletters, and much more. Let me show you how it works. When you sign up, you'll get three free credits to use, which will help you generate the content. I've already used one, so I've got two remaining. Once you're in the dashboard, all you need to do is paste in the URL of the YouTube video you wanna repurpose. So what I'll do is I'll grab this video of mine, I'll click on share, copy the URL, go back to repurpose, and then paste it in right here. Click on submit, and then that is it. Let the tool do its job of coming up with the Twitter threads and the LinkedIn posts and much more. And in just about a minute, the AI will turn that full length YouTube video into this Twitter thread that I can now paste into Twitter. I like to say X now, but in this case, it does say Twitter. Let's read out some of this. The way that Twitter works is you can create a thread. So you've got a post and then multiple posts underneath or part of that. So we've got unlocking the secrets to starting a business with $0 in 2024, which is the title of the YouTube video that I pasted in. And then the first point is research is key. Then we've got creation phase, promoting a product, content is king. These are actually all the points that I talked about and covered in how to start a business for $0 in 2024. So the AI actually did a really great job of turning it into this Twitter thread that's usable right off the bat. And if you wanna post it on LinkedIn, you can also use the LinkedIn posts right here that it's generated. And it's formatted specifically for LinkedIn posts, as you can see with the heading and the subheadings and the actual content, the points, and even a call to action. In terms of pricing, because auto repurpose is quite a relatively new tool, you'll see that you can sign up for a yearly $120 or monthly at $16 per month. So it's quite a steal of a deal considering what it does for you. Moving on, the next tool is called Chat with YouTube Summarizer. This tool is very similar to Repurpose, although the focus is on summarizing YouTube videos, turning it into articles slash blog posts. Here's one of the articles Chat with has produced. So you'll see the same example YouTube video, start your digital product business with zero investment. It's come up with that heading and also all the content and even getting down to the steps from step one, basic research, step two, product creation, step three, four, and final thoughts. It's even linked the thumbnail and also the original YouTube video right here. And the best part is the chat with YouTube summarizer tool is one of their free tools that they're currently offering to the public. So on their website, you may see this, right? And this has to do with their main tool. But if you scroll down all the way down, it's kind of hidden. You'll see here free tools called YouTube summarizer. Click that once. Grab the URL once more of any YouTube video of yours or someone else's perhaps that you wanna summarize. Going back to the tool and then pasting in the URL. And then all you need to do is click on generate article. And as mentioned, it may take a minute. And as you saw the article that was produced, this is what the result is. This is great if you want to quickly repurpose any YouTube video into an article or blog post, but if you want more flexibility in terms of changing the tone or voice of the article or writing style, then you may wanna take the content to ChatGPT and then prompt ChatGPT to turn the voice or style of the writing to something else such as professional, friendly, casual, or what have you. But considering it's a free tool, you can't complain. The next tool is called Exemplary AI. It's similar to the previous two tools, except with Exemplary, it repurposes long form YouTube videos into shorter form videos, into reels, and even other types of content pieces such as summaries, show notes, blogs, chapters, transcripts, and even tweets too. Let me show you an example. So I took one of my YouTube videos called five digital product ideas, and this is the result. We've got number one, a piece of content that 
is basically a summary of my entire video into this paragraph. We've also got titles that it's generated. It's got reels. This specific video didn't quite work out well as a reel, but it's also generated things like chapters, tweets that I can copy and paste, a blog that I can paste on my website if I wanted to, and even Q&A uh, sections like, like all this. And you'll see that it's auto-generated seven types of different content from one video. Now with Exemplary, there is a free trial and I think they measure it by minutes, but if you click on get started for free, you can sign up this way. And once you're in, what you're gonna to wanna to do is click on add file. And there are multiple ways of adding your media sources from your device. You've got social links from YouTube videos, Vimeo, TikTok, uh, direct URLs, Zoom, and much more. I've gone ahead and added my YouTube video right here. I'll click on import. And then one of the steps will ask you to select the content profile. And we wanna choose YouTube video if that's the type of video that or link that you've added or media source. And right here it says content that our AI will generate for you include summaries, titles, reels, tweets, blogs, keywords, chapters, and Q&A. And then what you'll do is click on process and let the AI do the rest. And as you saw before, the auto-generated content situated right here where you can go in and we can click on something like the summary. We've got the different titles that it's generated. It's got a reel that it's generated. You can also edit it. We've got automatic chapters that it's timestamped as you can see with the different timestamps. We've got tweets that now we can copy and paste onto X or Twitter, a blog post that it's generated to, and Q&A, as you saw. So Exemplary is a really handy tool if you wanna repurpose existing content of yours. As you saw with all these content pieces, what I can do now is use these pieces to then perhaps market and promote my YouTube videos to get more views, or perhaps just repurpose it in general. So that all that time and effort that I've put into recording this video and putting it up on YouTube isn't going to go to waste. Next up, a little change of pace, this tool is called Flipna AI. What this will do is, as stated on its landing page, is you're able to turn voice to text or speak to write articles. In addition, what you'll also be able to do is turn all those messy ideas, those thoughts and notes, perhaps on your phone, on your computer, to well-structured, ready-to-publish articles. Let me show you. After signing up, this is what the dashboard looks like. Of course, I've already got some of my pieces of notes here. And what you'll start with is by clicking on add text. Think of this as a project, a new project, all right? So give your project a name, and then you wanna choose a writing style from simple and clear to legal, journalistic, academic. So there's quite a few. You can change this later on. So don't fret. Now, once you've added your text, then you can go ahead and add notes, right? This could be voice notes. It could be text that you wrote on a notepad or wherever you have written or recorded all your notes. For instance, if you wanna add a new note, click on add a note. You can choose text note, live audio, an audio file that you've already recorded in the past, or perhaps subtitles. But let's keep it simple. Let's say text note, and I'll just say AI, is here to stay and is the future. All right, let's just put that in. And it could be as many notes as you want. All right, there's a little typo here, but don't worry. So you can add as many notes as you want. And then what Flipner will do is you click on action, click on a summary, and then it will turn all those messy thoughts doesn't matter what order you've put in and recorded all those notes, you'll see the articles that it's generated based on all these notes. So the first one says the field of artificial intelligence has seen remarkable progress, particularly since the introduction of ChatGPT. So it's actually what I talked about. You can see the original uh, voice note that I talked about here and how it's put it in here. So it structures all your notes so that it makes sense. I do have different versions right here, which is what you can do in Flipner. That's the beauty of it. So what you can do is choose the input language, different languages, also the changing the writing style. So let's say the first one sounds a bit too formal. You can change that to something like conversational and friendly and then rewrite it. You can rewrite it based on your original notes or from the last text that it's generated right here. It's improving on what's already been generated. Let's say from notes, and I'll click on rewrite. 
So then the AI will then recreate a new article based on this writing style that I've now selected. And in a matter of seconds, you'll see the result. It says, you know, ever since ChatGPT came into the picture, the whole AI game has changed big time. So as you can see, much more conversational and friendly. It may not be your approach, but it really depends on, you know, where you're going to be posting your article. And what you can do now with these articles is copy it onto your blog, could be on Medium, could be your own blog, on WordPress or on LinkedIn, wherever you want to copy and paste this to. Essentially, you're going to get well-structured blog posts slash articles based on all those messy thoughts. You can sign up to Flipna for free. There's five texts included or five projects, but you're limited in terms of the AI generated characters and a few other caveats, right? Otherwise, if you're looking to seriously use this tool to generate more content, then I will consider one of the paid plans. All right, the final tool is called Everlens. With this tool, you're able to create full online courses based on a simple text prompt and some fields that you fill out. Take a look at this example that I generated in just minutes. It's called Maximizing Productivity. It's a guide for content creators. You'll see this course curriculum structure with the modules and also lessons underneath each of the modules. So if I click on something like understanding the importance of time management for content creators, you'll see a full article generated right here. And with the online course that it's generated, I can monetize my brand or business and sell this online course. Signing up to Everlens is free. However, you can't publish it if you're on the free plan. Otherwise, if you're looking to upgrade, these are the plans as shown based on yearly. But before you think about pricing, let me show you how it works because it's, this stuff's quite powerful. Once you're in, click on new course. And then once you land on this page, you'll see all you need to do is fill in a few prompts here. We've got course topic, name your course. This could be anything of your choosing based on your niche, could be health and wellness related, personal finance or what have you. In this case, I've called mine Calisthenics 101, which is a form of exercise. And then you'll see target audience. This is where you put in the specifics of your target audience or who will be consuming your online course. Step number two is course overview. And this is where you can connect and add in all your media sources. So if you want the AI to generate your online course based on uh, works that you've done before or content that you've created in the past. If you click on the field, click on upload new, and then you can drop all your URLs. You can add multiple YouTube videos or wherever the sources are from. You can then start generating the course uh, with the references. But in this case, let's go ahead, try out uh, the generation, the AI generation without the references. So I'll click on start generating without references. And then as you can see in real time, it's generating the course curriculum. But let's go with this, keep it simple, click on next. And now it's creating a detailed curriculum of each of the modules, as you can see. Really great. <laughs> I think that's pretty solid right there. So click on next once you're happy with that. And then what it'll do is actually generate all the content for each of the lessons. You'll see now it has completed if you go here, you can see a summary of everything right there with five modules. Uh, but if you're happy with everything that it's generated, all you need to do is click on share. And right here, you can click on publish. Now, if you're on a free trial, you can't enable this, of course, unless you're on a paid plan. But I've upgraded my account, so that can be enabled, as you can see. And what I can do is grab this URL, copy it and share it, or let's say integrate with Shopify, WooCommerce, or whatever e-commerce system that you're using, let's say Gumroad. Uh, pay here, <laughs> lemon squeezy. I've got a few of those examples if you're looking to sell uh, your digital products and online courses in the description box below. But you can pretty much sell the online course that's generated right here. Of course, if you want to make some adjustments, feel free to do that. Add any other sources, images that you want. And speaking of which, let's go back because in each of the lessons, what you can do is click on any of the lessons. And let's say at the bottom right here, we can add interactive elements. So you can add a quiz, a mind map or flashcards, an iframe embed, but let's say a quiz so that 
it makes it more interactive and gets your student learning. And you'll see here, what is the primary focus of calisthenics? And there's a few options here. In addition to that, what you can do is add an interactive element, let's say a mind map. And right there, it's generated a mind map for us, giving us a bird's eye view of everything that is laid out in this uh, lesson. But that's Everlens in a nutshell, really useful and valuable tool there if you wanna repurpose your content into online courses. There we go, friends, five AI tools to help you speed up and take your content creation to the next level. Leave me know in the comments which of these tools you'll be giving a try, which one was your favorite. In the meantime, thanks so much for watching and do take care.